this video, we will learn how to operate a compression molding machine. Before starting, we will understand about the main parts of a compression molding machine. To start the process, press the motor on button, and lower the bottom part of the mold by pressing up down button. This is required to place the rubber perform into the mold cavity. Once the mold is opened appropriately, stop the motor, so that the machine should not get operated accidentally. Before placing the rubber perform into the mold cavity, it is important to weigh the quantity of the rubber perform. Less quantity may become a reason of underfilling of the mold cavity, while more quantity would also become reason for the excess rubber flashes. Check the rubber perform weight specification from the job sheet and ensure its correct weight. Once the correct weight is achieved, start the process of placing rubber perform in the mold cavity. Placement of the rubber perform in the mold cavity is very important and it has to be exactly as per the prescribed method. In this case, one piece of rubber perform has to be kept on each cavity of the mold. After covering all the cavities, if there are some rubber performs which are remaining to be placed, then those should be cut in further small pieces and should be kept at the prescribed places. Now we will start the curing process cycle. After getting the signal of cycle start, the machine will close the mold for curing. After mold closing, there will be a degassing cycle, which ensures that there is no air entrapped inside the mold cavities. Now the curing cycle will be continued for next 2 minutes, as per the process specification. As you can see the curing cycle time, which was 2 minutes, is about to finish. After completion of curing cycle, the mold will open automatically. We can see, rubber perform has been converted into the desired part shape and now it is fully cured. Now we have to carefully remove the cured parts from the machine, since the mold will be very hot. The next step is to deflash the cured parts. The deflashing tool is selected based on the flashes to be removed from the cured part. Once deflashing is completed, the parts are sent for further inspection, packing and dispatch to customer based on the customer schedule.